Hello and welcome to Dancing Numbers. After installing and connecting Dancing Numbers with QuickBooks Desktop, we can start importing, exporting, or deleting the information to or from Excel as required. To export, we can click on Start. And today, from this list, I am going to choose subtotal items, which are going to be the part of the transactions, such as invoices. Now, if you would like to specify a name for the subtotal item to be exported, you can do that. Similarly, if you would like to specify a date or a date range, you can do that. Or if you would like to export the inactive subtotal items as well, you can choose that and click next. Here, it's going to show you the subtotal items with the details, with the name, description, and if it's active or not active. And if you would like to choose any certain field, you can do that and click OK and go next. Here is going to be the final preview of what is going to be exported into Excel. I'm going to click on export file. If the data needs to be exported into a new workbook, into a new Excel sheet, you can choose that. Or if you would like to select or export the data into an existing one, you can select that and click OK. And straight away, the subtotal items are now exported into Excel. Thank you.